Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bobby Kryptonite here, and welcome to another Bobby K Bikes video. Now today, we're going to show you how to make your very own headset bearing cup press. Um, they sell these headset tools for oh, around 50 quid on Amazon. They're, they're very expensive tools, and if you don't do a lot of rebuilds, they're probably not worth it. Maybe I should invest in one, but when I was doing the Falcon, I made one of these, and it did a wonderful job. I went to Wix and I had to go to B&Q for some other parts the other day to make this. Um, they didn't sell the bits individually so I can't sort of cost it as if you were buying it individually. I'll, I'll maybe try, I'll do a few calculations and see how much you'd be paying if you were buying bits individually. But for everything that I bought it was probably around a tenner and it was enough to make two of these. Now I'll show you what you'll need laid out on the work surface. Now you're going to need a piece of threaded rod, some nuts, some washers and some big flat washers. Um, as for the nuts and washers I'm using two of everything right now but we may need more, we may not, let's play it by ear. So what you need to do is slide a washer, a big washer on each end then a little washer also on each end then a nut as you guessed it on each end very often with a headset there will be one thin cup and one fat cup in the case of the falcon it was thin cup at the top fat cup in the bottom but if you, and it, i believe it should be that case if you're not sure though if you look at the way that you're, if you're fitting a new headset, if you look at the way that the headset's packaged, you'll see which ought to be top and which ought to be bottom. Now, here's all the nuts up here, which is where the stem attaches. So going by that, this ought to be top and this ought to be bottom. Here's hoping I'm right. Okay, you'll see the head tube has been thoroughly cleaned. Now what you should do is just put a slight amount of grease around the inside surface just to help those new cups slide in a bit more easily. Next place one of the new fork cups in position now take the tool that we made earlier, having removed the nuts and washers from just one end and put it through. Then get the other bearing cup into position and place the washers and nut below it. and tighten up until both cups are sitting in place nicely. Then take your two spanners, put them in position on the nuts and tighten up. And there we are, new headset cups just about installed. Don't do things too tightly, but check clearance periodically. So there you are, that's how to make and use a bicycle bearing cup press. You can use this on headsets, you can use it on bottom bracket bearing cups, so I've heard but I've not quite tried it on bottom bracket bearing cups yet, but you can certainly use it on headset cups. I'll maybe post the cost of making one of these tools in terms of individual parts in the description below. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and that you've learned something from it. If you did, please give the video a like, follow me on Twitter, like the Facebook page for this channel, and I'll see you in the next video. Tatty bye!